Hello everyone. Welcome to week three. In this third module, we are introducing you to industrial design or product design, a field that I think flies under the radar in mainstream culture. Almost everything in our human built world has been shaped by industrial designers, yet most people know very little about the field. Not only do industrial designers develop mass produced products, but they also design systems, services, and experiences. These might include things like consumer appliances, tools, business, business machines, furniture, medical equipment, architectural products, transportation devices, uh, just to name a few. These days, industrial design has converged with scientific research from biology and genetics to artificial intelligence and robotics, allowing things from the realm of science fiction to actually take shape in real life. Many industrial design practitioners address problems of the other 90% of the world, trying to solve problems of poverty, hunger, energy, health, and other troubling issues of the disadvantaged world. And they've come to realize uh, that responsibility for the planet's climate and limited resources through the handling of the environment industry and agriculture is something that is extremely important to their profession. To give you a closer look at industrial design, we've selected a broad array of materials for you this week. Um, all the materials, as usual, are available in the Module 3 folder in the weekly module file on UB Learns. For a solid introduction to the discipline, first take a look at the PowerPoint that I've prepared for you, and then read John Heskett's chapter on industrial design. He basically, John Heskett is an historian, an industrial design historian, and he uh, gives you a pretty good overview of the history of this profession, but he also criticizes the profession for being a little bit too Eurocentric. Then look through the Industrial Design Society of America's Ideas Award from last year to get a sense of the latest award-winning products in industrial design. And then finally, watch two videos. One is called Cradle to Cradle, which explains more sustainable methods of production. And then there's another one uh, on how artificial intelligence is impacting the way that we design our worlds. After you've completed the activities, you are ready to take the 10 question quiz, which will then come, which will of course cover all the materials for the week. And of course, um, the main show usually is your participation in the discussion group. There are two good questions this week, which will give you the opportunity to practice the first part of the see it method again. And then finally, uh, you can, if you have a little extra time, check out the something fun category, as well as the supplemental materials category. In the supplemental materials, there are two pieces that are particularly important. Um, one is about the human bias in AI, and that's a wonderful TED Talk. And then the other one is a full-length documentary that's won lots of awards. It's called Objectified. It's by uh, someone named Gary Huskett. And, uh, that film is a great film. I didn't require it because it's just a little bit too old, but it's still loaded with great information and it's a really interesting presentation of the whole concept of product design. So if you have a little extra time, go in there and look at those materials. Anyway, have a great week and I hope something wonderful happens to you within the next seven days. Take care. Bye-bye.